New at 9, a trip to the dog park turns into a horrific scene for a dog owner in Chandler. Some guy fatally stabbed this other man's dog to death. Fox 10's Lindsay Regis is at the Shawnee Dog Park near Alma School and Elliott Roads tonight with the full story. Yeah, Tani was just one year old when her life was taken from her at this dog park. Ever since then, her owner has been out here talking with everyone in the community, handing out flyers, warning them about what happened. Fun evening at the dog park turned into a tragedy for Conrad Calderon's Pipple Terrier mix, Tawny. Conrad says he was about to leave the dog park when his dog heard the main gate open. A man and two dogs just came into Shawnee Dog Park. There was a very, very brief scuffle and I picked up the pace as soon as I heard it. But literally, like by my third step, it was over. Um, and by my fifth step, I had arrived. Conrad says two people saw exactly what happened as he was walking over to his dog. The wife said, uh, he stabbed your dog twice. And so I got closer and I saw her. That's when I saw her intestines sticking out of a knife wound. The clock was ticking to get Tawny to a vet. Conrad didn't have time to confront the man who stabbed his dog. He was a tall black man with a bald head and he had two large dogs with him. I believe they're Dobermans or... Uh, some type of mix of that. Tawny was fading fast. That same night, she had to be put down. Somebody really hurt me bad and took away something special to me and my girlfriend and my other dogs. Ever since the attack, he's been at the dog park hoping to find answers. What I need to worry about is keeping my nose to the grindstone and, and finding out who did this. And uh, I would love it if they were charged criminally for animal abuse or animal cruelty. Chandler police say they are investigating this incident. Anyone with information is asked to call their non-emergency line. Reporting in Chandler, Lindsay Regis, Fox 10 News.